Here we have a couple of our orchids from our collection, Salinopsis moth orchids. I have two selection Catalina crossbreeds orchids. The beautiful um, lady slippers, uh, Pathiopedlum. And this is a good example of a dendrobium. When I'm choosing orchids for the collection, I always kind of think what is going to grow for me here in Virginia in my climate, in my conditions I have here in the greenhouse. So Virginia for me, I grow um, more intermediate to warm orchid species because our summers get so hot here. In your home, it might be a little different. Uh, if you had in your air conditioning, you might be able to keep it a little cooler. Uh, but when I'm actually just looking for orchids to add, I look for a reputable nursery that tries to strive for clean stock that doesn't have any viruses. There are several viruses that run through orchid collections. What I look for is good roots on the, the orchids because that's like kind of the staple of how it is on a healthy plant. From there, you're going to look at nice green leaves and a good vigor to the plant as well.